WHO allows you copy me. Michelle Obama burns with rage humiliates Meg in Boos for copying her outfit. On Friday September 24, Meghan Markle went for her second official joint engagement with her husband Prince Harry since their daughter Lilibet's birth. The Duchess wore a monochromatic maroon suit while visiting Harlem's PS 123 Mahalia Jackson School. She completed her look with a $4,500 diamond ring by Burks, Princess Diana's $23,000 Cartier tank watch, a $6,900 Cartier love bracelet, a $3,000 Jennifer Meyer tennis bracelet, and her $350,000 worth diamond engagement ring. While Meghan looked smart and classy in the suit, some on Twitter joked that the 40-year-old stole Michelle Obama's style for the outing. Meghan's outfit was very similar to the former First Lady's head-to-toe plum suit by Sergio Hudson, and which she donned for President Joe Biden and Vice President Kamala Harris' inauguration ceremony in January. Michelle's outfit was in purple color that consisted of a floor-length coat over a form-fitting knit turtleneck and wide-leg pants. She accessorized herself with a matching belt that featured a large gold buckle. While the 57-year-old's version was more structured, Meghan's look was relaxed. Reports said her reversible coat was made from double-faced cashmere that came with hand-finished invisible seams and a ribbed, cashmere knit, detachable collar. Several people took to Twitter to make fun of Meghan's outfit. A user tweeted, imitation is her speciality, when she was trying to snare Harry she dressed as Diana all the time. This tells me that she wants the Obamas. Political Ambition, 2023. Another one wrote, Channels. She tried to copy hashtag Michelle Obama and failed miserably. Hashtag Meghan Markle should fire her racist bully stylist hashtag Jessica Mulroney whoever let her leave looking like that must secretly hate her, her outfit was frankly horrible. A critic said, yes, the discounted version she ordered on AliExpress, another one added, I guess some people like sloppy seconds. In other news, Prince William is unhappy at Meghan Markle still using her royal title as she voiced her dissent to the revocation of Roe v. Wade in the United States, a royal commentator claimed. Prince William is reportedly questioning Meghan Markle's decision to openly share her view on the change with feminist writer Gloria Steinem in a recent interview. Members of the royal family traditionally avoid speaking out about political issues but with her departure from the institution, the Duchess of Sussex has not refrained from discussing her views on controversial matters. Reporting on claims from sources close to the Duke of Cambridge on his YouTube channel, commentator Neil Sean suggested the royal is unhappy that his sister-in-law is still using her royal titles when speaking in a private capacity. Mr. Sean said, this has really become a big hot potato. It all really stems from the fact the one-time royal Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex recently given interview to Gloria Steinem for a glossy magazine. It's all about the Roe v. Wade debate. But, as ever, once an associated member of the British monarchy comes forward and starts getting into that political arena, it can become damaging. According to a very good source, and as ever we have to say allegedly, Prince William is unhappy once again at having to work through the mire of what these particular associations mean. The royal commentator claimed the Duke of Cambridge is concerned about former working members of the royal family stealing away the focus from the cause he and other senior royals are trying to promote. He continued, when you look forward to William and Catherine, they are very busy promoting their own charities as are Prince Charles and the Duchess of Cornwall. So whenever you have a situation moving forward when an associated member of the royal family can grab the headlines, it's not a case of jealousy. It's more a case of, really, is it right? And it throws up the problem once again of the use of royal and associated titles. He continued, how can Prince William stop his causes from being overshadowed by someone who is simply not a working member of the monarchy but still using her titles? A source close to Prince William tells me this will be a radically different situation should and when he is in a position to do something about it. The Duchess of Sussex sparked controversy after discussing her opposition to former U.S. President Donald Trump ahead of the last presidential election in 2020. She was then questioned for cold calling U.S. politicians to lobby for equal parental leave for U.S. parents. Speaking to Vogue, 
The Duchess revealed she and Steinem have been working to get the Equal Rights Amendment ratified as she warned of the risk the repeal of Roe v. Wade poses to women. Risk the repeal